what's up world you're back and you are with your girl cinnamon and today I have a very inspiring story for you from one of my passengers I think that everybody should sit up and take listen check him out what's your name Taylor 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 I just picked you up here in Atlanta yes, ma'am. we're doing we're, we're doing pretty good so far because we've had a lot of rain right that's right I think we're supposed to have some hail today I hope not oh my probably. god yeah I told you that and you were like oh my god I hope not because you have your own business what I do you do a, I'm a landscaper I have my own business landscaping and on the side I do HVAC I'm an HVAC technician now oh cool and um the story I'm going to tell you is well, you look, I wait, to, wait 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 you look like a musician what are you holding this is a ukulele play the ukulele guitar saxophone take up some music it'll take up your time free time do you, <laughs> do you sing? I do sing a little bit. Yay, I have car karaoke. Yeah, I do sing a little bit. Why don't you sing a little something for us real quick? All right, I'll sing you a song I wrote. Okay. You don't have to do the whole song, though, okay? All right. Here we go. Okay. I'm excited. I am asleep, I can't wake up. drug addict that's what I want to talk about really yes I started when I was very young and at 18 I got addicted to heroin using a needle shooting cocaine meth everything you can think of oh wow got me in a lot of trouble I was stuck in a hole I went to prison I got out tried all the same bullshit oh, bull crap over and over <laughs> again and I went back to prison wow and I was stuck in a hole for about eight years, and I decided to change my ways, and I moved here to Atlanta, and I've now started my own business, I've took up music, and I've been doing nothing but spreading positivity, and the way you need to get out, the word I want to preach right now is this, if you're a drug addict, these are the ways you get out, you have to want it, if you are addicted to drugs, the drugs are going to tell you that you want that life, you want anything that has to do with getting your drugs. You have to realize that you cannot live that life forever. You have to want to live a better life. As soon as you want that, you your, your possibilities are endless. I'm a five-time felon. I have three high felonies. I uh, have repeated drug offenses. I have violent offenses. I have numerous misdemeanors and I am still out here owning my own business making money and living my life because all I want to do is want a better life you can do anything if you want to be a doctor I don't care if you've been a drug addict for 10 years you can go to college if you want to work hard enough you can become a doctor work hard wow. perseverance dedication keep going uh, people that give up on you don't let them give up on you. Just keep going. Go, 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 go. Hit the ground running and don't stop. Well, what? why were you in prison so many times? Selling drugs. Doing drugs. I would sell drugs to do drugs to support my habit. And I got a little crazy with it a couple times. And, you know, you end up, you know, selling drugs to too many people. And you get told on and everything like that. Where were you? Where, you weren't in Atlanta, uh, I was you? not in Atlanta. I'm from Toledo, Ohio, around Toledo, Ohio. A place, a little town called Defiance, Ohio. Oh. And it is an epidemic up there. Really? It's an epidemic up there. And you're now how old? I'm 26 years old. Wow. You're young, so you have a, a really good chance to build uh, to build the type of life you're talking about. No kidding. You know? So you're not... Tr you're not ever going to go back into that, right? You cannot go back into it. No, I will never go back into it. 
I have no, I don't even think about it anymore, honestly. When good things start pouring in, I mean, the bad things leave your mind. Well, That's now true. you said you were in a, a, a car accident or something? No, I was not or, in a car accident. Well, I, well, my back hurts right now, but that's just because I heard it going to Shaky Beats, Atlanta, 2018. Ooh, crazy. <laughs> um, something you said you were you and your girlfriend were involved in. And oh, yeah. A video. I have a video. You can look it up on YouTube. It's a couple overdosed in Toledo, Ohio. I'm in a black shirt and a Chrysler 300. I died that day. They had to bring me back to life. I got posted viral on the internet. It embarrassed me. It embarrassed my family. It, uh, you know, brought a lot of shame in areas I didn't couldn't take any more in. But uh, just a reminder that you can die. It can be you. I've had people that I thought were going to be in my life forever pass away from drugs. They, they're gone like this. Your best friend, your sister, your dad, your mom, your kids. If you have kids, I have kids. And just, you know... I don't know people just how did she is she okay too she's okay she's in prison now <laughs> um, I don't really like her <laughs> no, <laughs> but you know what I mean she's she's alive and she's in prison and I'm hoping that she's working on herself honestly so I hope the best oh we don't get into the we don't want to get into the baby mom situation <laughs> oh, oh so she's your baby's mom yeah. how many kids do you have I got three three of them in Toledo yeah oh different old town yeah well, your story is so inspiring. Thank you. I, I really, and and you have a really good singing voice. Well, thank you. I like. I don't. It. I don't like it that much, but some people like well, it. My I'm sister's a, beautiful singing voice. I am a vocal coach, so you got in the right car today. Oh yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Awesome. I'm going to be having uh, some more vocal workshops, and I'm going to invite okay. you to come to one of them. I would love to. I didn't work on my vocals. I got the instruments almost down. I, Ukulele is new to me. I just picked up the ukulele a month and a half ago. So. Wow. Well, do you want to send a shout out or give anybody your social media to keep in touch with you? Well, with their comments? my social media is Facebook is SWAT Man. SWAT Space Man. And you know what? If you need to get a hold of me or any advice, I'll be glad to give it. I got true story and I got proof and I can show you what it takes to get clean. That's for sure. Oh, that's a blessing. Well, thank you so much. Tell everybody your name one more time. Taylor. Taylor. All right, you've been listening to Taylor's story. I think it's very touching and inspiring. Please comment below. Give us two thumbs up and try to get in touch with Taylor, okay? You never know what the results will be. I'll talk to you soon. It's your girl Cinnamon. Bye.